Hi guys, real quick, there's actually a part one to this video, which is the final video. It's probably gonna make this one make a whole lot more sense. If you prefer to see the final result and then the creative process and everything that went into my mind to make it happen, then I'd encourage you to go watch that first. If you'd rather see the sporadic thoughts that happen in this video and the creative process and then watch the final result after, then hey, watch this one first, up to you. Cool, thanks guys. I think a good creative challenge for the day would be to execute on an idea that I've kind of given up on. In fact, I already kind of started a project file for it. That's a cool idea. I forgot about, I filmed this, I forgot about that idea. So then there's some sort of transition here, like a top-down shot of me lying on the floor looking at the camera, going, see, I've spent most of my life feeling guilty about such and such and such. I think it'd be fun to do a stop motion, actually, it'd be hard. Oh, but it'd be fun. Duh! These are the things. I want to create these videos that are this good. Like, I can imagine this. But then I'm like, but YouTube requires consistency. And how the heck am I consistent on YouTube? Ah, That's how I struggle. And then that starts. And then I'll do some drone footage of it circling around me and getting... Good song. Not for this video. Nope, not for this video. Like, what if the only reason you help people is to get recognition for it? Have you ever questioned your own motives? See, this song could almost work with, like, the speed and of the beginning, but it's too hopeful for how negative my script is to start. Nope, none of that's working. Okay, this is the creative process for you. So let's listen to the beginning again. It goes, this build. That do 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 is kind of what I'm looking for. I love visuals and I'm a visual person, but I really love building in the story through audio first sometimes and seeing how then I can portray the visuals to match up with that audio. It's got the right that I want, but it's too hopeful. Interesting. Very abstract. Like, what if the only reason you help people is to get recognition for it? This is a pretty artistic song, very artistic approach to the whole thing. It might change my visuals a little bit if I chose to use this. All right, so I think I'm gonna record a script. This Sometimes I do this just to give myself an idea of what it's gonna sound like. Have you ever questioned your own motives? Have you ever questioned your own motives? Going into my mind right here. Gotta think of the visuals. Have you ever questioned your own motives? What if that beginning scene is me driving in a car thinking and there's some flashbacks like to like um, me doing some good things with people and then I'm back to the car like complimenting or uh, thinking about it. <laughs> um, and then there's a car crash, but it's really me just like, like it's like, but it's me just waking up from sleep, but it's a car crash. Okay, so I just changed. I'm gonna go film because I have two hours before the sun goes down and I wanna get some footage rolling uh, for this video. We're gonna try to figure out how to make this look cinematic, okay? Because I'd prefer a lens that could separate me from the background a bit more, but I don't have that capability right now. <laughs> Too bad I wasn't shorter. I often use a lens cap in situations like this. Why is my camera gotta be so big, huh? It's such a good camera, I wanna use it. So what does this look like? <laughs> this is honestly, it's rough. This is the challenge of filming yourself, you know? Uh, filming someone else, I could do so many things, but the perspective of the wheel. I think that would be the easiest and most stable shot and maybe tell a story, but I just did this recently. But would be to shoot me in the rear view. Yeah, right there. I like it. Can my tripod do that? All right, <laughs> let's see what I can do. It's gonna be a challenge. Oh. I don't know how that just got into that position, but oh my gosh, that's like almost perfect. Happy accidents, it's my favorite. Oh, my biggest prickle, oh, ouch. 
This is actually gonna work. Stable enough for driving. What does it look like if I look in the rear view mirror? Look out, look this way. Am I in focus? I think so. Okay, so now I gotta think about the location that I want to drive in. I'm filming in 24 frames per second. Okay, good. I don't watch for that sun on my face. I can't have any of that. Okay, so I'm not in love with it. This is a really beautiful area. I'm curious what the 50 will look like on there. Because then I can isolate myself a bit more. Okay, lock my doors in case there's any creepers where I am. <laughs> Let's see what this looks like. That's why filming and driving is dangerous. <laughs> So I put on this shirt because it seems like it's a pajama shirt <laughs> um, and might be good color contrast. It's actually pretty intense color contrast, so do I love that? I don't know. Okay, so the light is pretty strong right now, but I want to get the framing. The goal is for me to lay down and pop up like this. It would be nice to have negative fill on this side. What can I use? What can I use? Nope, oh, of course. Okay, let's see how that looks. I had this laptop set like this with the um, white full screen and that was lighting up my face from the other side. Yeah, this was a source of fill. Sometimes you gotta do some, you gotta make do with what you got. It's really hard to film yourself and to create a story <laughs> uh, filming yourself. I think that this is in focus. All right, well, my camera died. My camera is out of battery, so um, phone it is, okay? This is absurd. So beautiful. So beautiful. And that's a little glimpse of what it looks like to make these YouTube videos. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed the chaos. Thank you so much guys for being here. Thank you for your support. Thanks for sticking around. And if you're not a subscriber, I encourage you to do so. Um, I'm working hard to show up as much as I can here for you guys. So. As always, thanks for watching. I hope you're all doing well, and I'll see you next time. All right, bye guys.